Hi friends, I have a book to read with you today called What If I Know My Feelings? And it's by Michelle Nelson Smith. I want to invite you when we go through the book to try making a face for each feeling that we read about. You'll see that the illustrations are making some faces for each feeling. And I'm going to try making a face for the feelings. And you try at home making a face that is for each feeling. You ready to give it a try? Here we go. You feel your feelings every day. What if we learn about them today? What if I feel happy? I can smile at others. Did you try your happy face? What if I feel sad? I can find someone to talk to. You try a sad face? Let's see what's next. What if I feel grateful? <laughs> that was my grateful face that I gave a try. You wanna try one? I can give a friend a hug. What if I feel angry? I can close my eyes and count to five. Let's try. Close our eyes, count to five. One, two, three, four, five. That did help. What if I feel brave? I can try something new. What if I feel scared? I can ask for help. What if I feel friendly? I can wave hello. What if I feel shy? I can watch until I'm ready to join in. What if I feel silly? Oh, my silly face is kind of scary. I'm going to try another one. I can laugh <laughs> and play. What if I feel serious? I can sit and read a book. What if monsters learned like you? Now they know their feelings too. The end of the book, but not the end of our time together today. I really like books that talk about our feelings because it took me a long time to be able to think about and to talk about my own feelings. And I'm not sure why, but I always thought that I had to be okay or that I had to be happy or making other people happy too. And what I actually have found as time has gone by and I've had some experiences that have really taught me and I've learned um, is that the more I pay attention to the way that I feel and the more that I acknowledge, that's a big old word, but the more that I say hello to the feelings that I'm having, the better I feel and the better the people around me feel because they know um, that they are being with the real me. Does that make sense? I wonder if you at home have ever felt like you have to feel a certain way or you have to show people a certain emotion, a certain feeling. This book, What If I Know My Feelings, is really wonderful because it helps us understand some of the ways that we feel um, and some things that we might do when we feel those feelings. <laughs> that was a lot of the word feel. Um, but what I wanted to get across to you is that it is okay to say hello to all of these different feelings. And if you need help with um, 
moving through a feeling or maybe you don't know what feeling you're having or maybe you're uh, really overwhelmed um, and overwhelmed means like maybe you just don't know what to do about a feeling that you're having then there are people to talk to another grown-up a friend um, and saying hello to those feelings helps you to be able to let them go also and to move on to a new feeling just like the angry monster do you remember we counted to five to kind of help us move through that anger all right everyone thanks for listening and thanks for reading with me what if i know my feelings and i'll see you next time bye